What are you looking for? I'm looking for the cheese. Oh, uh, it's gone. What? I ate it. You, you ate the bondage dog? Yeah. What do you mean? Why did you eat it? It's not because your cheese. It's delicious. It's not your cheese. It's my cheese. Well, you left it here for a day. I left it here to pick up. I told you I was going to pick it up later or tomorrow. This is tomorrow. It was in my refrigerator, and I believe possession is nine tenths of the law. Uh, what's the other ten? Fucking over your friends and eating yeah, their cheese? Yeah, is I that the other know. tenth of the law? Huh? Maybe. Let me ask you a question. If I took a nap on your couch, could you go through my pockets and roll me over like a drunk? You'd make such a big magilla over nothing. It's not over nothing. I went all in Bethlehem Hills to pick up that cheese. Oh, Jeff, he's complaining that the Vonderdonk is gone. Good cheese. Yeah. You had it too? Uh, it's in a sandwich. Yeah, a melt. I made him a melt. Who are you people? You know, I think it's time for you to leave. Yeah, you know what? I think you're right. I think you're right. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. You're taking my pomegranate yeah, juice? Yeah, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. It's mine. I got the pomegranate juice, and I'm possessing it. It's nine tenths of the fucking law. Oh, hey, Herman. Hey, uh, Larry David. I know Larry, yeah. Uh, yeah. Did Lewis uh, talk to you? No, I didn't. I didn't hear from Lewis. What? Well, I, I didn't. Never heard from Lewis. Unbelievable. So. Well, I specifically called him up and asked if he could get me clearance. He didn't call me, so technically this is a uncleared conversation. It's like an ambush. I don't know what to say. I'm very embarrassed. Yeah. I'm a little mortified, frankly. Why would you go up to someone if you hadn't gotten the okay from Lewis? Because I just assumed that Lewis was going to get the you clearance. You don't assume stuff like that. Oh, I assume this boat has plenty of life preservers for everyone. Oh, no, it's the Titanic. It doesn't. This will go a lot better once I get some clearance. Well, will, 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 you, will you think about the clearance? Sure, yeah, I'll think about it. Uh, you're not going to think about it. <laughs> That's just something people say you know, when they, when they yeah. want to say no it's and they let the person down a little easier. It's true. They say they're going to think about it's it. It's true. I don't know how many times I say, yeah, I'll think about it, and I just want to get out of that situation with the person. But you yeah. won't spend one second thinking about yeah, it. No, the minute I'm gone, I'll never think about it again. Totally. That's totally. a great observation. You see, if I had clearance, yeah. these are the kind of observations you'd be hearing all the time. You should talk yeah. to Lewis. All right? Yeah. We yeah. good? Yeah. Well, look, you got one of those uh, firehouse dogs, huh? He's never been in a firehouse. It's a stereotype. Can you stereotype a dog? Yes, you can stereotype a dog. Oh, that's a golden. He must be a really friendly dog. Oh, there's a Dalmatian. He must live in a firehouse. He goes to fires. This is the kind of conversation I'm trying to avoid. There's a reason this protocol's been around since early sound days, 1932, 33. I read an article about somebody approaching Fatty Arbuckle without clearance. And Fatty Arbuckle just broke a beer bottle over his head. Yeah, it's been a while since I've heard a Fatty Arbuckle reference. What, did you just come from Margaret Dumont's house? Okay. Lewis. Uh, uh, Lewis, I thought I had the clearance. It's I'll, a system. Uh, yeah. We have a system for a reason. I'll go through the system. Yeah. Okay. Call Lewis. Yeah. 